What's going on everybody? Welcome back to another video. Hope you're doing well, feeling great and enjoying freedom. It's a great day to have a great day. Today I want to talk about why I like 90% junk constitutional silver and how much of it it takes to equal a troy ounce of silver. We're going to get into it, but really quick, just in case you're new, make sure to subscribe for daily videos. Subscribe to my second channel for weekly videos. Get yourself some DYDSS merchandise to help support the channel. Remember, we've got the limited edition Halloween gear available in orange, gray, and purple only this month. Get one while you can. Try out some G Fuel Energy Formula. $5 off your first order by clicking the link in the description. And of course, make sure to go and get your up to 12 free fractional shares by downloading Weeble and funding your account. Refer a friend for free. 15 fractional shares and refer three friends by the end of the month to win all the way up to 20 free shares of Apple. And if you make your first crypto trade, they're going to give you $5 worth of crypto of your choice. Everything will be linked in the description. So today I wanted to talk a little bit about this 90% silver, the constitutional silver, the junk silver, whatever you want to call it. So I got one quarter one dime and one half dollar right here in my hand. To be more specific, we have a walking liberty half dollar, we have a Washington quarter, and we have a Roosevelt dime. To be even more specific, I'd tell you what the years are, but I can't even see them right now. So I wanted to talk about some of the reasons why I like 90% silver so much. And the number one thing when it comes to 90% silver is the fact that it's silver on a fractional level. I've talked about this time and time again, but for the newer people out there, you might not realize this, but if you were to just go and get 10th ounce or quarter ounce or half ounce silver bars or rounds, the premiums are wild. Constitutional silver, like this in my hand, a much better way to go. The premiums are a little bit up there because the premiums on silver in general nowadays are kind of up there, but I would say this is a far better way to go. Not only is it a lo is it of a lower premium, but higher level of notoriety. Easier to recognize. Everyone in the world knows what this stuff is right here. Take it to any coin shop in the world, boom, you're good to go. So when it comes to 90% silver, you might be wondering how many of each coin do I need for it to equal a troy ounce of silver. Now, before I let you know, you might also notice that there's something else that you can see on frame. Just by looking at what you can see, yeah, of course, there are some silver coins, but guess what? There's also a little silver ring. Now, you might be wondering, why do you have a pinky ring? Now, number one, it's because I'm Italian, but two, and more importantly, this was actually made for me and sent in as a gift from JT, from over at JT Coin Rings. If anybody's interested in checking out what they have over there or what they can make specifically for you, go to jtcoinrings.com. JT, once again, thank you very much. I appreciate it. Now, as for constitutional over here. Oh, and by the way, that is a silver, 90% silver. Delaware State Corner. So when it comes to the Constitutional, it takes $1.40 worth of Constitutional silver coins to equate to a troy ounce of silver. So of course you can mix and match them up. Think maybe, I don't know, one half dollar, two quarters, four dimes. Boom, right there. That's $1.40. That's a troy ounce of silver. Or you can stack up 14 silver dimes. That's $1.40 right there. If you're going to work with quarters or half dollars, though, without using dimes, you're going to have to go over a little bit because there's no way of getting to $1.40 with just quarters and half dollars. You can get to a dollar, you can get to $1.25, you can get to $1.50, and that $1.50 is probably where you're going to have to go unless you can play around with some dimes. So I just wanted to make a little bit of an appreciation video for 90% junk constitutional silver and, of course, 90% junk constitutional silver rings. JT, once again, I appreciate it. If you guys like today's video, please hit that like button. Subscribe if you're new. Subscribe to my second channel 
which is my backup channel for exclusive weekly content. Go and get yourself some DYDSS merchandise to help support the channel. Remember, we got the limited edition Halloween gear only available this month. Get one while you can. Purple, gray, and orange. Try out some G Fuel Energy Formula, sugar-free, low-calorie, packed with a whole bunch of vitamins, 50 different flavors to choose from. This one happens to be peach ring flavored. It's delicious. I recommend it. It tastes just like the candy. And of course, make sure to go and get your up to 12 free fractional shares by downloading Weeble and funding your account. You can deposit as little as you'd like, even a penny, and it still works. Refer a friend and get 15 free fractional shares for the referral. Refer three friends by the end of the month, and they're going to give you all the way up to 20 free shares of Apple. And if you make your first crypto trade on the platform, they're going to give you $5 worth of a crypto of your choice between Bitcoin, Ethereum, Doge, Sheep, and Cardano. Everything will be linked in the description. I want you guys to head on down to the comments and let me know anything and everything related to today's video topic. What are your thoughts on 90% junk constitutional silver coins? And uh, apparently rings as well. Thank you guys so much for watching. See you tomorrow. Don't you dare stop smiling. Peace.